man, oh man. And just like that, we're back at it again with another giveaway, except this time it's super useful. As you can tell, I'm sitting on a Bobcat. That is a low trail dump trailer, and that's a Ford. Let's get into it. So first things first, I have to say this immediately. This is a two week giveaway. Now I can finally say it once again, we're back at it with some more crazy crap with Omboss Plyco. We are wild for doing this. Now usually we do six week long giveaways and they're a little more expensive and they're a little newer of a truck and the trailer's a little bigger, but man, for two weeks, this is a badass giveaway. So I'm gonna go into every single detail of what we're giving away. And uh, as you can tell, it's a shorter, but in my opinion, a more versatile and compact package. You guys love this. We did this one more time for OB15. Show them, Mitch. OB15 was pretty sweet. It was a John Deere dump trailer and a GMC. Now we got a Ford dump trailer and a Bobcat. Let's go into it. Let's start off with, you know what, dude? Let's start with the skids here. The Bob, I think the, the dump trailer is more interested in the skids this time. This is a 2022 Bobcat T66. It's like a 9,000 pound machine and uh, it rips. I love these. It's the same thing as OB23. It said this time it's not paint matched. This thing has just under 800 hours on it. So if you guys know anything about machines, that is very, very new. It's a nice machine, man. Super, super sweet. I'm very blessed to be give it away and, and it can make you a lot of money, man. It's not even a quarter of the way through its life cycle. Not even a quarter. This thing probably can go four or 5,000 hours with no problem at all. No tint, it's stock. No, we haven't done anything to this thing. We didn't sticker it, nothing. So it's the Bobcat, the way it comes from the factory, sitting right here and uh, 2022, 700 hours. It's sick, very workable. Let's go, next thing. So this is a 2024 low trail, 14 foot gooseneck with 7,000 pound axles. Let's get the bed lowered down and talk about it a little more so you can kind of understand what's going on. First of all, you come in here. This is where you control everything at. If you guys never used a dump trailer, here it is, pretty cool. Open silicone contraption up over here. You have binder storage right here. So you can see in here, it's pretty cool. You have your binders, whatever. Your pumps in here, your hydraulic fluid if you need to fill it up, and your battery. Dude, it's not hard to use these things. Look, you have up and you have down. You got down, boom, coming on hot. I like this trailer specifically because the hydraulics on the outside, they're not like a scissor in the inside and basically you can maintain this faster. You can check your fittings, you can see if stuff's leaking really easily. You don't have to go underneath the trailer and do all this crap. Like, you can see all your hydraulics, your lines, everything, literally right here. So, really cool, good design. Low trail logos, it's a seven gauge steel all the way around. The floor is seven gauge, the sides are seven gauge, comes with a spare tire. Uh, you come to the back, you have a scissor style opening for the doors with these nice little D-rings. You're like, what? what are those there for? They come around like this, check this out, boom. And they hook on right here. Now the doors don't move out when you're dumping. Your ramps actually are underneath here. Open this up, there's your ramps, you got two of them. They pull out, they hook on right here, and then you come to the side of it, and the cool little feature is the add-on actually has auxiliary stands. So when you're loading your machines up, you can lock this in there and you don't have as much flex in the, uh, in the trailer. So you drop these down, pull this pin, boom, pin it back, both sides, and now you don't have any weird movement. Make our way down to the side of the trailer. You have one max step. It's a huge step. Big fan of this. Two feet on there. Grab whatever you need to grab. Miners, chains, whatever. And then you have your nice dandy tarp. You want to tarp up? You unhook this. Pull your tarp out. Reel back. Done deal. Super easy. You have your plug over here to charge your battery at night over time. And past that, guys, this is the dump trailer. Tap test, baby. Feels freaking solid. This thing, I bet you, you could drop some concrete in here and wouldn't F it up too much. I mean, F it up but not too bad. So far, we have the Bobcat T66, the brand new low trail dump trailer, 14 footer, and now we're making our way to the creme de la crop. The Super Duty, check it out. It's F350, it's a King Ranch, it's rapid red, it's on JTX forged wheels, it has a nice little leveling kit, and other than that, the entire truck is stock, the entire thing. Suspension, it's a leveling kit, but really it's stock suspension, stock shock. In our past, and what we usually do, we like ruin trucks in a sense, but like, man, dude, an OEM vehicle, we just some wheels on it, drives so freaking, and a haul so freaking good. I wanna show you the interior of this thing. The KR, the King Ranch, dude, it's super clean. But yeah, guys, I mean, realistically, this giveaway is just all about opportunity. I'm gonna show you right now exactly what that looks like. I'm gonna do a little demo of moving some material around, depending on your area and how fast it is, how big the job is. But moving a pile that I'm about to show you, you charge them a lot of money for. I know a person locally that rents these exact trailers out for like 300 bucks a day. That's not just the trailer, not the machine, not the truck. It's just, he drops the trailer off, Picks up, 300 bucks. Give you a little demo and uh, pass that guys. This is literally a two week giveaway. Let us know in the comments if you guys like the dump trailers and the single wheel setups. 
let us know, man, because we, we really enjoy it, because the opportunity with this is just crazy. We're gonna find out in the comments. We're gonna see what you guys think about it, and I'm gonna show you a little bit of maybe you can get creative and go, damn, dude, that could be me, because it could be me. <laughs>